We have two little vitamin water bottles here, and we're gonna play kind of a drinking game. And I think I might have to do. Is, are you okay? Was there too much partying going on? In I the think Hollywood we should drink series? for that. Yeah. <laughs> All right. What's up guys, Nikki Novak here in the Young Hollywood studio with Project X star Thomas Mann. Because the film is about a party, right. we are gonna have, we have two little vitamin water bottles here and we're gonna play kind of a drinking game. Did okay. you see the Oscars where every time Scorsese was yeah, called yeah, out, yeah. the bridesmaids yeah. girls? So anytime, yeah. We're gonna ask our producer to shout out a word. I don't know what it's gonna be. Party. Anytime okay. that yeah. word is used, you and I have to drink. Okay. Are that's you a game? Good one. Yeah. Yeah. Let's party. Here we go. <laughs> we just started out with the cheers to to vitamin water. Vitamin water. To partying. So yeah. I heard that the filming there was like. It was like 5 p.m. to 5 a.m. every night for like five weeks. Is that true? Uh, yeah, yeah. It was really, it was intense. To the break of dawn, yo! We had a DJ on set too, and so he was there, spinning like even between takes and stuff. So extras would be dancing, and a, a lot of the time it felt like you know the line was kind of blurred between movie set and uh, you know high school. So was he party. actually supposed to be in the movie, or he was just there to l get people going? He did it again, didn't we? Didn't even notice. He's a DJ in the movie. Right. You see him, um, but then you know between takes, he's also a DJ. So we're going to take advantage of that, obviously. Right. And it was necessary because yeah. you know shooting that long for the, uh, you know that late at night, it's like you get delirious at a certain point. And you're so exhausted, so we need something kind of on set to keep the energy up. Dad, hey. Yeah. Well, we just wanted to call one last time before going to bed. Make sure you're all set for the night. Yep, all good. Um, I'm actually about to uh, go to sleep right now. So it was truly, uh, it must have been like the most fun environment to shoot. In. It was amazing. It was the most unique ex set experience that I'll, I think I'll ever have. I, um, it, was, it was really amazing. So 20, not even 21 yet. No, not even. When is your 21st? Uh, September. Oh, you gotta wait a while. Yeah. So what are the bit. plans? I'm like halfway there. Um, I don't know, <laughs> I was thinking, people always ask me, and I think I might have to do, is, are you okay? Was there too much partying going on in I the think we Hollywood should drink studio? For that. Yeah, <laughs> all right. I'm gonna go to Vegas. Yeah. I have to do it right. Right. I'm gonna be 21, no one's gonna have to hassle me anymore. Uh, you know, I have to do it. Maybe I'll hate it, who knows, but I think it's something, it's like a rite of passage. Have you never been to Vegas? No, well, oh, I, I have really? been, but not as not as an adult or party person. I was, um, I, I really didn't mean to that time. I We're used, just those kind of people, we just uh, talk. <laughs> the thing is, I used to have family in Vegas, and so I would go as a little kid and do like all the all the fun things there, but now you're gonna have I've never, adults. yeah, yeah, it's gonna be Did a whole Did you ask Todd thing. Phillips for some tips? Um, no, I mean, he's well, the king of Vegas. I know, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna ask him to hook me up when I go for sure. You I'm should sure bring Zach. Everything. I should. I'm, sh yeah, and we'll stay at the Caesar's Palace, just like <laughs> in the movie. Absolutely. You know, we're gonna recreate it. And you could steal what's his name's tiger. What's his name? Mike Tyson. With Mike Tyson. I Mike should Tyson. never say that. He could come after me for not knowing his name. <laughs> you should steal you his should tiger. Watch out. This is good. Okay. I think I want to plan your party for you. You want to do it? I swear I didn't do that one on purpose. That one okay, just flew out. Whatever. You have another movie coming out, Hansel and Gretel. Hansel and Gretel, yeah, it comes out um, in January, and that's with Jeremy Renner and Gemma Arterton, and it's like massive. Like it's insane. It's um, it's an R-rated, you know, fairy tale. Yes. Which you know they're, they're kind of doing a lot of now, but this one's yeah. really fun, and it doesn't take itself too seriously. It's like. Um, Sort of like the Tarantino-esque vibe, you know, it, it's really dark and kind of very bloody, but it's also really fun. And, and Hansel and Gretel was my bits favorite, of comedy in it too. like growing up, it oh, was really? my favorite. Well, it's a little bit different than that. Now they're grown up and they, now they kill witches, so. Oh really, so what, are, yeah. so what are you doing in it? I, I are you play, killing um, witches? No, well, I, I do. I don't know if I can say. That's, um, he I become, didn't. I become their, uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm their like crazy fanboy. I'm like obsessed with Hansel and Gretel. They're like these witch hunting celebrities, <laughs> and um, and and so then they come to my town, and I, I make make it my mission to become like their sidekick. Well, thank you very very much for coming in. It's yeah, been a real you party. You knew it's I was going to do it. It's been a real party. That. All right, that's we a take double. A really big chug this time. Let's do it. Let's right, bottom this sucker. 